Hi there, Chris here. I was just talking to a friend of mine, and we were talking about um, Schlage Everest cores, and um, I said it's basically a Schlage keyway, but it's a little different because it has a little that little edge that goes down, and what that does is guide this this side of it into this. It's kind of a check pin. And when the key is in it, you see this is, is, has been pulled up out of the way and the, and the core can turn. But when the key isn't in it, you see this blocks it. Even if you picked all the top ones, you still gotta pick this. So, and this was one I was working on for a challenge lock. But, Here's just a regular stock one, and it's in this uh, 6200, no, 26, <laughs> 2606. Oh, series A3650. I don't know what that is, but uh, but these are these are generic. You could put any kind of kicks in them you want. So I put this Everest in there, and I thought I might pick this. So. I usually use fairly light tension. They pick up out like a schlag. Um, you see them here in California. I've seen them in like doctor's office. Uh, I went to the cancer doctor once. Ooh, that was scary. <laughs> and they had one on their, on their doors. They had them. And then I've been to dentist's office and they've had them. So basically, I try and get some pins set. And you can get all these pins set and you'll you'll get a the slightest false set and then you can go down and, and the way to get that pin I use this baby pick um, and I just go in along there and go until I feel it stop and then I want to rotate up and what I've done is I've set that check pin so it is now out of the the way so at this point I gotta pick the rest of the top the regular top um, pins and sometimes it falls down sometimes you'll be picking through this if you haven't set it first and you pick pick through all of these and then you go and set it and you get your open or sometimes you can't get a pin set, so you want to go in there and check and see that it's been picked in the up position. So we'll see if I can get this. I picked this before on my channel a ways back, three, four months maybe. And I'm probably using too, too heavy a tension. Or my little check pin has fallen down. But it feels like I'm not, I haven't done my work up top, so I'm not worried about that just yet. I really pay attention and feel these pins. And it's possible my tension wrench is influencing sitting on that first pin. All right, so at this point, I'm going to check again. It feels like it's still up. So I'm going to try a different tension wrench. 
I'll try this guy here. It's a lot shallower, so it's not going to come in contact with the first, first keep in. Boy, do I suck today. Well, let's see where that guy is. Can't quite feel him. I might be... The core might be have too much pressure on it to set it, or it's set. So go in. Actually, it feels like it's out of the way, so maybe we'll rake it or rock it. Or maybe we'll never get it open. Oh, that's a problem. Suki fell down. <laughs> maybe I should need to leave a link to the where I actually pick it. Oh, sheesh. Everybody's springing. Which generally means you've overset something and you... So then you re reduce your temp tension and hopefully your pin falls down and then you can get back in the game. see. How about no? Some sets. <clears throat> Let's wave this thing. Do the echo wave. Just have a no look. Zero luck. Oh, I forgot it. Skill beats the luck, not luck. Skill always beats the luck. Well, I must have left my skill outside when I was sitting out there.
Okay, I got a good chord turn, so maybe we're there. Or maybe there's one more top pin. Let's see. Actually, I felt it go up and I felt a little bit more chord turns, so according to me, <laughs> we're one pin away. So we just have to find it. Is it four? Okay, nobody moves. I don't think I lost anything. I'm gonna try the check pin again. It looks like it's up. Double check. Give me my pick back. Okay. Can't find it to save my life. Okay, last call for raking. <laughs> This much trouble. Maybe I was open. Holy moly macaroni. All right. Um, I'm not going to gut this because it's all they're all standard pins, but I will uh, take the core out to show you that it has the little guy. And there we are. So you can see it's it's um, been moved out of the way, and all these guys have been picked painfully. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. That's the Everest. I'm sure I picked it a lot faster last time, but that is how it goes. And you can tell Everest Core because they have this little Albert LaBelle uh, logo on them. You see right there? Looks like Albert LaBelle's logo. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. Hit the like, subscribe, focus, and we will see you next time.